what's going on guys um, welcome to Cryowood and welcome to the next uh, video on uh, C++ in the last video as you guys can see we explained um, function like macros and we changed our swap to numbers it's a number A or B and that's the layout from the um, last uh, video so in this video we introduce you guys to the it's the same like uh, function like macros but it's a ternary operator if you guys uh, seen that so what is a ternary or conditional operator all right so we leave from the, say um, we leave this uh, defined and because we want to do it in macro and we want to say that if you guys want to find the minimum or maximum uh, a or b so you guys uh, put your um, um this hash here and put define and you guys can put anything minimum or maximum so a or b and we clear this way it's the same it's going to be the same uh, layout but it's a little bit different all right so in this one you guys add uh, another parenthesis and inside that we see going to see that we want to evaluate the function a or b so we leave another parenthesis and you guys can uh, add a you guys can put a condition a or b so that's how the situation comes in all right so we're gonna put it in um, another parenthesis and we're gonna put our a and we put a less than sign if a is less than b all right so in this one and we go one this side and we put a question mark so it's a and we put a colon and b all right so this is called uh, function like macros macros and this is a uh, ternary operator this is how ternary operator you guys see that the first line before this one it's a uh, condition and the second one it says either a or b or either one or zero so that's um, uh, called ternary operator if you guys uh, uh, not familiar with this one so now it's the time to get familiarize yourself with this one all right so in this one we at, at the bottom we put a x or y all right so we put an int x y and we now we want to give a value our uh, it's up to you guys want to do give value so uh, if you guys want you can put a sin our if you guys want say uh, int x y you can put um x is equal to 20 and y is equal to say 50 so is it x or y all right so we put a c out c out okay in the c out we put at the um, because we, we are looking for the minimum not the maximum the minimum the minimum minimum number is okay so you want to find the minimum number and we want to put a min and what's the minimum x y x or y uh and then, okay that's how we're gonna find the ternary operator whether it's a or b so we come here run and compile defined mean a b i remove this this parenthesis is here what about this one this one's all the way to the end okay so mean a b okay so sorry this is got nothing here it's we wanna we don't want the parentheses in there because it's a operator the last one was a function this one is operator all right 
so the minimum is um, 20 as you guys can see the minimum is 20 okay so we remove the parentheses uh, I thought um, the last function this was was like a function type function type macro this is the it's got a, even it's got a parameter but this bit you can call this function but this is called ternary operator it, the first bit you guys put a condition and the second you guys put a, a question mark here and then you evaluate the condition whether it's a or this colon here is or or b so that's a, a ternary operator you guys can put a maximum here max here so you want to see the maximum is it maximum or a or b and you guys put the same thing and you guys can put a 30 or y say leave the y on uh, 50 or you can put it any other number you can put it 90 up if you want and you guys here put a maximum uh, maximum number okay so you guys can find the maximum here all right so the oh which we gotta change this one the maximum not the maximum mum the maximum number is and you guys see the maximum number the maximum number is 90 of course that's the maximum number so that's how we do that alternative operator or conditional operator we do condition here we put the question mark and we put a colon I think you guys are gonna see this uh, every now and then in uh, PHP you guys see in every programming language so and this is the C++ that's how you guys do, do this uh, uh, ternary operator with this macro uh, you guys can even take the value from user so put a C in uh, or you can put a C out see out enter value one and then you do endl and see in we'll give it to x do the same thing okay do the same thing and give the give it to value y for the computer to store it so now the computer is gonna get two value from the user and we evaluate the condition from the user all right so we go the value one uh, one sec value two I forgot to do this all right now we come in here so the value one we give it to 100 and the value two we give it to say 50. the maximum number is 100 so that's what we uh, asking user to insert the numbers and when the user number we tell the user which one is the maximum number so that's how we do that uh, using this uh, defined macro as you guys see the defined uh, the C++ uh, symbolic constant and that's processor preprocessor is very useful you guys is and it's very neat uh, it's the same as if else if you guys uh, see if else if you're confused so it's the same as if else if we evaluate first the condition which one then uh, this question marks asking which which of these numbers gonna be uh, Meet, meet this uh, evaluation like this condition is because that's a maximum we are, we want to find so that's how it is very simple all right uh, that's it for this video i'll hope you guys like the video and thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video bye